Hello friends, so here we are with uh, another boolean expression which we have to implement using NAND gates. So this uh, whole expression if we want to implement it using NAND gates we have to convert or we have to modify this expression such that this OR sign, this OR symbol gets converted into AND. We have to modify this expression into AND form so that all the variables that are present they should be in product form or AND form. So for that we will use this double complement rule. We will take double complement of the above boolean expression which is A A B complement or C double complement ok so now it will become a complement or a b complement or c whole complement ok so we converted this and into or using this rule x and y whole complement is x complement or y complement. We use this rule, the first de Morgan law here to convert this and into or. Okay. Now we can convert this or into and. So we'll use this reverse de Morgan law, which is x or y whole complement gives us x complement and y complement. So, a b complement or c whole complement can be written as a b complement whole complement and c complement. So, we can write this as this. So, we will simply remove this portion and replace it with this a b complement whole complement c complement ok using the second de Morgan law. Now again we can convert this or symbol into and using the same law as this which is a complement complement and a b complement whole complement c complement complement now we know that the double complement of something gives us the same so this becomes a complement a simply a and a b complement whole complement and c complement complement so this is the modified boolean expression. Now all the variables that are present in this boolean expression they are in product form in AND form. Now we can easily implement this ok. We can easily implement this using NAND gates. So let us do it. So now we have to implement this modified boolean expression in AND form using NAND gates. So first let us represent the individual signals A, B and C. Three signal variables are present. So first we have B bar. For that we will pass this B through a NAND gate to get us B bar. Then A and B complement whole complement. So for that we will pass these two signals A and B complement through another NAND gate which will give us A B complement whole complement. Now we require C complement. So for that we pass C signal through a NAND gate. So we got C complement. Now we require 
A B complement whole complement which means this and C complement whole complement ok the end of these two signals whole complemented so we can pass this uh, two signals through a NAND gate ok to get the required signal A B complement whole complement and C complement whole complement this portion is complete now we require this with A so we take the A from here ok we take the A from here pass it through a NAND gate so this will give us a and A B complement whole complement C complement this whole complement pay attention here this gives us this A which means this A and this expression and it together then whole complement because these two signals A from here and this signal they are and it together and then whole complement because it is a NAND gate now if we pass this signal again through another NAND gate this top complement will be removed because double complement of something gives us the same then we will get this required signal Y which is A A B complement, whole complement, C complement, this, which is this portion. When we pass it through another NAND gate, this complement gets removed. So we get the original, this expression. Okay. So this is the whole uh, logic diagram. So it took us 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 NAND gates to implement this Boolean expression. Okay. So at any point, if you don't understand, pause the video there, practice it in rough and then move forward. Okay.